Hey guys, in this video I'm going to tell you about quite an insane build for protection when it comes to burst. Uh, this is PvP by the way. Uh, so all through Legion we were pretty like focused on healing mainly. Uh, we didn't have that much damage at all, but that's quite different now in BFA. Um, especially if we have the right uh, trade setup. So the thing I'm going with is of course Seraphim, because 1k stats right now on everything that's quite it scaled really well from Legion to BFA, that's for sure. Um, let's see, PP talents. I still like going for immunity and the silence and some more healing. But if you're really going for damage, then I would suggest Inquisition or Warrior of Light. Though Shield of Righteous is not that good for damage. Anyway, um, so Seraphim is one part of the burst. Then we have, of course, Avenging Rot. I mean, our normal city makes sense. Uh, and we will always focus Judgment during the CDs, because it's our main damaging ability. And then I say you go for the trait uh, Aven Avengers Might, because it boosts your mastery during Avenging Wrath by quite a bit. If you had three of these, that would be amazing. I don't even have that right now. I have the shoulders, I do not have the head nor the chest. So the head you can get from uh, uh, Freehold, Harlan Sweetie, uh, the last boss. In yeah, in Freedom. You can see here. Uh, sea Brawler's Great Helm is the name. Uh, shoulder I got from PvP. And that's one of the better ways to get it. Even if it's RNG. <laughs> RNG, but that's like all the asset pieces. Uh, so chest, you can, I think you can only get good ones. Well, semi good ones from World Quest. It's the Bleak World uh, chest plate from Drustwar, I think. Or one from uh, Nasmir that's like the Resonance Blade Guard or something, like the name of it. Uh, I'm gonna share with you in the description a link to Icy Wains. They have an amazing like page you can check through all different traits, where to get them, like which piece has it, and where to get those. So check it out. And then the last piece for the burst are the trinkets, of course. I got this amazing one. Then increase my primary stat by 1 or 5k, which is amazing. And then I'm unsure. Sometimes I use this that procs pure stats, like 600, ma uh, 600 strength. Or I sometimes stick to the passive baseline, like 200 strength for, you know, most other trinkets. Um, but yeah, and I'm also quite high in idle level. So I'm going to show you some battleground footage. And the reason I do it in battlegrounds is because I can use potions and make it look even more awesome. It won't be that awesome arena, but it will still be very strong. And I haven't really gotten a good comp going yet in arena. So I I'll leave the arena footage for, for another time. So yeah, so let me show you. And... Hope you enjoy. 